The following is a public service message brought to you by the Corporation for Responsible Computing and the WITS Help Desk. Unprotected computing can result in worms, disc disease, or data cancer and may greatly complicate the completion of your degree requirements. And now, the Surgeon General. I come to you with both good news and bad news. First, the good news. Our anti-smoking campaign has been extremely successful. Smoking by computers has been almost completely stamped out. Admittedly, the nearly 100% mortality rate experienced by computers that do smoke has contributed greatly to this achievement. But that does not diminish the benefits we are all experiencing. Information technology managers write to me daily, thankful that they no longer need to set aside smoking sections in their computer labs. But now we must turn to a more insidious threat, the viruses and worms that threaten the health of our computers every day. These pernicious influences reach into the heart of some of our most respected institutions and thriving businesses, disabling or even killing our most productive machines. Yet you can prevent the spread of these diseases by following the ABCs of responsible computing. A, antivirus software. Install it and keep it up to date. B, be wary of email attachments. Your girlfriend will not send you a pinup picture of Anna Kornikova. The dean does not really love you. If a message seems strange to you, stay away from the attachment until you can confirm that the message really came from the apparent sender. C. Computer updates. Both Windows and Macintosh computers can be set to download and install updates and security patches automatically. Use this feature. These three simple steps will work wonders for the health of your computer. With your help, we can eradicate the computer infestations now plaguing our network. Thank you.